Hey, let me ask you something. Good evening, YouTube, and especially the YouTube pod community. It's a magnifical coming to you again from my balcony. And again, getting the housekeeping out of the way. I'm smoking black shag, which I need to tin, or jar, I should say. This is uh, definitely lit up a lot quicker this time. I'm smoking it in one of my Capris. This one is designated exclusively as a Virginia pipe. Tastes different than in the clay. Tastes very much like a Virginia though. A little mild, I think. So that's good. Although yesterday when I had it in the um, in the clay, I thought I got a little bit of a spiciness to it. I'm not getting that right now. Anyways, welcome to episode five, I believe, of Pipe Smoking WTFs. Yes, this is what this is, as you saw from the intro. So first, let's go over last week's uh, questions and answers. So last week I asked what is the um, nominal, what is the best, what is the absolutely number of pipes that I should own. Actually these are two weeks ago episodes, questions, but anyways. I got a lot of answers, so thank you to everybody that uh, gave me an answer. Um, I got any uh, answers varying from you should own as many as you want to you should own as many as you can afford to I used to have started with three and now I have more. Um, I just actually purchased three more or two more from um, our buddy uh, Sapien Smoke, Mari. Anyways, I think the correct answer should be 42. After all, 42 is the answer, the ultimate answer, the answer to everything. Excuse me a minute. Uh, but I don't know. I guess it, it varies. Uh, a lot of people said if you smoke once a day, you should at least own seven. I own more than that, and I, I sometimes smoke more than one bowl a day, so I think I'm doing good. The other question was, what is the one pipe that I should have? And a lot of you guys said red black pipe. Uh, I think Papo47 said uh, Mark Volkabek. I need to look into those. Um, I really want to get a church warden. Uh, some people say get a Meerschaum. I already have a mini Meerschaum. And I saw Band of Briars, both um, King B and Brent. No. Mick. I uh, get this really claw uh, Meerschaum, so I think I, I want one of those. <laughs> but anyways, so yeah, various, various um, answers. Uh, also, somebody said I should have one of each. Uh, so yeah, maybe. I already have uh, six cobs, three clays, quite a few bunch of briars. I don't have a church warden. Mm, damn it. Too much talking, not enough puffing. All right, so a change of format to the show because I am running out of questions. And yes, I have received some emails from you guys or PMs. But I'm going to change the format from asking two questions a week to one question a week. That way it will be easier for everybody to answer. Uh, I noticed that um, in, in last week's episode when I got a lot of comments, uh, people either answered just one or the other. A few people answered both. 
So I think to keep it easy on you guys, I'd only ask one question also, that gives me a chance to get more questions. So, let me put this down. I have a show and tell. Today's question is related to pipe cases and specifically about pow pouches. Now this is uh, one that I got from Amazon. It, it holds um, it can hold up to four pipes. Right now, oops, sorry. Right now I have two in there. Um, that's usually uh, you know carry two every day. Uh, I haven't actually. I didn't even get to use them this time. Um, but it has this and it came with a, uh, this, this power pouch that can uh, be inserted into here. So the question is this, how do you use, what's the proper way to use a tobacco pouch? Uh, so that's question one. So actually, since I'm asking one a, a day, this one has actually multiple. Uh, so what's the best way to use this? Do you only use one pouch per tobacco or uh, do you use the same pouch for multiple tobaccos when you, you know, for like when you different trips. How do you clean this? Um, do you just dump the tobacco, put it back in the jar, or and then you pipe it down? What's the proper way to clean this? Uh, do, every time you use it, do you put a humidifying disc in there? Uh, and that's it. Those are the questions. What's the best way to use this? How do you clean it? Do you only use it for one tobacco? Um, of course, one at a time, duh, unless you're blending your own stuff, but one at a time. Uh, like if I wanted to put black shag in here that I'm smoking, I probably would do so at some point. But let's say I carry that for one week. Can I use this one the following week with a, a different blend? And, or can I, do I need to get another one for each uh, tobacco? So those are the questions. Leave them in the comments. Thank you so much for watching. If you like my videos, uh, make sure to give me a thumbs up. If you are a new pipe smoker or you have a pipe related question or um, you are a lurker and you cannot make your own videos and would you and you like me to ask the question, please send me a PM, put in the title um, pipe question or pipe WTF as the, the subject for the uh, PM and I will use them on the show. Thanks so much for watching. I look forward to reading all the answers. Uh, until I see you again, this is a magnifico saying, may God bless you all, so long, and thanks for all the fish. Cheers.